There's an angle in Purdue games that continues to cash in college basketball. I'm going to tell you the best way to play this game between Nebraska and Purdue tonight on Tuesday and use that angle and make some money when you do so. Hi, I'm Steve Merrill, wagertalk.com, right back here on Wager Talk TV, breaking down your primetime game at 9 Eastern between Purdue at Nebraska. A big battle in the Big Ten. Two teams are combined 26 and 4 straight up this season. Yet Purdue is a seven and a half point road favorite, one of the best, if not maybe the best teams in college basketball right now. And I'm going to talk about an angle that my friend Tyler Cobb pointed out to me last season, and it continues to cash, and that's playing Purdue first half. Yes, Purdue's been a good team against the spread overall this season, but they've been even better first half. In fact, Purdue is 10-4 and four against the spread overall this year, and if you look, they've covered five of their last seven games, but the two games in which they have not covered, they still covered the first half line in those games. Talk about the Illinois game the other day. They had a ended up winning by just five as a 10-point favorite, but they covered in the first half. Even back at the end of December, they were a 29-point favorite against Eastern Kentucky, won by 27. Well, the first half, they were up by 19. The first half line was 17. Going back to their last straight-up loss in non-cover before that, you have to go back to December 1st against Northwestern. Another game they lost outright in overtime, but they actually covered. They were up by like eight or nine at the half as just a five-and-a-half point overall game favorite. It's amazing how Purdue does this. They continue to cover the first half lines very reliable. In fact, a lot of games they don't cover even when they covered the first half still. So if you're going to play Purdue tonight, instead of laying the seven and a half, I would recommend the minus four in the first half. Odds makers really have not made the adjustment. This line is only about half of the game price. And therefore, if you like Purdue here, I think minus four first half is the best way to play it. Let's dig a little bit deeper into this matchup itself. And oh, by the way, Last year, these teams played twice. Purdue won by 18, covered as a 15-point favorite. They were up by 11, I believe, at the half in that game. And uh, the other game, though, against Nebraska last year, if you recall, back on December 10th a year ago, Purdue lost that game. Um, they won that game 65-62 in overtime as a 7.5-point road favorite. But guess what? They were up by 10 at the half, got outscored by 10 in the second half. So, yes, Purdue was 1-1 against the spread last year, but they were 2-0 in the first half against Nebraska as well. And I look for a similar this game to play out a similar style as well. I think the big edge Purdue has here is on the defensive side. Nebraska, bad loss at Wisconsin on Saturday. A 16-point loss. It's just a five-point road dog. Gave up 55% shooting. Also gave up 47% shooting at home against Indiana before that. Um, and going back to their game against Minnesota in early December, another Big Ten opponent, they gave up 47% shooting in that 11-point road loss. So they have not stepped well, stepped up well defensively in conference. So the 39% that they're allowing overall this season, extremely misleading in my opinion, because in the four conference games, they've allowed 48.5% shooting. Meanwhile, Purdue has held their opponents to 39.5, and they've held their four conference opponents to just 40.5. So I think the defensive edge, size down low, is going to be the difference in this game. Purdue gets out to a fast start like they always do. If you're going to play it, lay it, but lay the first half minus four. It's a better option than the full game as Purdue continues to cover first half lines even when they don't cover the full game lines. Hey, if you found this information useful, give the video a thumbs up, a like, and comment below. I read all the comments. I reply back. Let me know your thoughts on this game, how you're going to approach it, what side total you like in this one between Purdue and Nebraska at 9 Eastern tonight on Tuesday. And don't forget also hit subscribe and hit the bell for instant alerts so you know when my NFL playoff preview videos are up later this week. Also, my NFL Fade the Public Wild Card Round is available this weekend. Hit subscribe and hit that bell for instant alerts. And if you're ready to take a serious approach to sports investing, now is the time to do so. I have a one-year all-access special still available for an instant 41% discount. I made this offer at the beginning of January because I wanted everyone to start 2024 off right. Well, I know many of you sat back. Many of you got on board, but some of you sat back. You missed the rest of the college football season. We finished with a nice best bet winner on Michigan last night, 9-2 and two to finish the Bulls over the last couple of weeks. Bad news is you missed that. The good news is if you jump on board now, you get a full year still. 365 days, which means you get the first week plus of January 2025, which will get you all the way through college football next year. So you're going to get a full year of college football, NFL pro football, full baseball season coming up in a couple months, and the rest of this year's college and pro basketball into next year's seasons as well. Not a bad offer. And hey, I know we're talking college hoops here, but don't forget I was number one in the NBA last year, up 40 games above 500, 103 and 63 in the NBA alone in 2023. And the last two years, 2022 and 2023, football sides, college and pro combined, number one. Number one in college hoops a couple years ago. Number one in baseball totals a couple years ago. 
Great time to get on board in all sports, all access, and save an instant 41% discount. Promo code SM365 is what you use. It's on my page right now. I've got two strong college basketball best bets tonight. If you want to try out just tonight, I have a two-for-one combo special for the College Hoops best bets. Also, a bonus free play tonight. Don't forget about those daily free plays. Free College Hoops play and two best bets tonight. Get them a la carte. Get them for one day, one week. Or the one-year special works out to just over $3 a day. That works out to just over a dollar and a half per play for the next 365 days and nights. Check it out on my page right now, Steve Merrill, wagertalk.com, and get there quicker with shortcut wt.buzz slash sm. Hey, comment below. Once again, I read all the comments. Like, subscribe, and don't forget, follow me on Twitter, at Steve Merrill, 2Rs1L, at Steve Merrill on Twitter. And also post free plays throughout the week on Instagram. Follow me on IG as well. And stay tuned right here for more great college and pro basketball preview videos coming up next.